A fugitive wanted on three local warrants held Spokane Valley Police at bay for five hours this morning. This happened in the 1300 block of Bowdish Road near Opportunity and University Elementary. Police say Sean Driver claimed he had a high-powered rifle taped to his hands and wouldn't come out of his father's home. KXY4's Cherison Ramsey talked to him just after his arrest. Neighbors were told to stay in their homes. Sheriff's officers say Sean Driver was armed and had barricaded himself inside his father's basement. SWAT negotiators spent hours trying to convince Driver to surrender. He did, after pepper powder was deployed. And I said, get the hell out and kick the door shut. Driver was booked into the Spokane County Jail wearing a dirty tank top. In my jailhouse interview, he admitted to many crimes. Man, I did a hidden run in my blue Mustang. I'm pleading guilty to that today. Done diddly, I did it. But Driver did not admit to any wrongdoing this morning. I'm actually not guilty for one. That's what's crazy. Three Spokane County warrants were out for his arrest, with charges stemming from theft of a motor vehicle to forgery. Sheriff's officers call him a 20-year criminal. In 1996, he escaped from prison in a prison van and ended up in the Tri-Cities. Talk to me about that part of your life. 20 years old, didn't care. Driver acknowledges he's been convicted of 14 crimes, including first-degree theft, possession of a controlled substance, and attempting to elude police. I ain't got no money. Ain't no baller. Don't even steal cars no more. Don't make no money. Just work. He claims he has given up that life of crime. I'm a man now, not a boy like I was. It's stupid. But sheriff's officers say when they searched his father's house this morning, they found a realistic-looking BB rifle and an airsoft pistol in the shape of an assault rifle. They also found a roll of duct tape and a magazine for a real firearm. There's my kid's BB gun there and soft air plastic pellet gun. Come on. As for the grief he may have caused his father this morning. Sorry, but I didn't do it. And finally, he has a message for the neighborhood. And I hope the neighbors don't hold it against him. Because he had nothing to do with none of it. Reporting in Spokane Valley, Cherston Ramsing, KXLY4 HD News.